Still ahead here on Six in the Mix, looking ageless might be easier than you think. Best-selling author Dr. Shino Bay Aguilera joins me with some secrets next. What is the secret to staying youthful is to be youthful. A renowned cosmetic dermatologist shares his secrets to looking great at any age. Dr. Shino Bay Aguilera, author of Be Youthful, is here. Dr. Thank Shino, you. welcome Thank back. It's me. been a while. Um, let's get right to it. When you say to take charge of your facial architecture, what does that mean? Well, aging has to do with architectural changes of the face. Uh, it's plain physics and physiology. So there are certain events that happen to all of us according to your genetics with the architecture of the face. When you enter the 40s, you start looking older but not elderly. You just okay. look tired and gone. When you get to the 50 and beyond, you start losing bone and changing the architecture of the bone. Now we do have a lot of technology where we can preserve or imitate the architecture of fat and bone so you can look in your 50 like you're in your 30s now. Oh my goodness. Wow. Hey, we got to have more of a conversation about that. What can we do? I mean, what, is it ever too young to start taking care of your skin? What are some things that we could do 20s, 30s, 40s, and 50s to help? Well, there's, there's never too young to start taking care of your architecture. The way you're going to look at 50 is when did you start preserving the architecture of your mm, face? Okay. So what I tell my patient is that it's easier for me to move something up that drops two centimeters than two inches of one foot. Gotcha. So if you see something changing, put it back. You know, you will do use less material, so you're always going to look natural, but you're never going to spend a lot of money and achieve a natural look. Doctor, let me ask you about the skin. How, what is? What are some things that maybe we are doing or not doing throughout our day, daily life, day-to-day -day life, that really causes the most damage to our skin? And how can we fix it? How can we prevent it? The most damage to the skin is is the sun. Yeah. You know, abusing the sun. You know, there's no such a thing as a healthy tan. When you get a tan, it's a way of your body telling you that it's getting damaged and it needs to protect from mutations that will lead to skin cancer. So trying to, you know, to protect you, yourself, especially the skin on the face with sunblock uh, during the day and antioxidant during the day. And at night you want to use something like retin-A or retinol okay. to repair the sun damage. Now, I know this is, we're just scratching the surface here. Of course, as we said, you just wrote this book. And I love that you talk about the importance of feeling youthful and being youthful on the inside and how that automatically reflects on the outside. So there's a, a lot of things that we could do on the inside before you start working on the outside, right? Definitely. If you don't do that, it doesn't matter what I do to you. you people need to remember that beauty is ageless. And having self-love and self-acceptance is the best way to stay useful. It doesn't mean to have inattention to the way we look, self-acceptance. It means that you need to love yourself every decade. And that is the absolute truth. <laughs> it doesn't help. It doesn't hurt to have you in our lives as well. <laughs> Doctor, congratulations thank you so on your much. book and thank you for sharing some of your secrets. I appreciate it. For more on Dr. Shino Bay, visit shinobayderm.com. You can also get more information on his book at beyouthfulbook.com. And a portion of the proceeds from this month will be donated back to raise awareness about domestic abuse and domestic violence. So thank you so Correct. much for that.